got it. We forgot the long lens, so this is uh, technically take two. Round two. All right. Might make it somewhere this time. All right, so here's the deal. We are uh, going out to my buddy's, Buddy's Ranch. And from what I hear, it's like a slam dunk out there. This is a pretty good size ranch, but I hear that they're about as smart as town turkeys or uh, in the turkey community yard <laughs> turkeys. And uh, so it sounds like a slam dunk, but whenever I try and do something like this, it never turns out to fail to be harder than originally anticipated. So the goal today actually is to kill a turkey, make turkey jerky, this evening go out and kill a bear. Fair? Sounds good to me. I think so. So, but you know, you know those home projects that you start and then they, uh, like they're supposed to be like a half an hour project and then they turn out to like a whole day project. Oh, yeah. And the cow yeah, hopefully that's not this. Because <laughs> it could be. <laughs> Uh, it might be. <laughs> it's a pretty good chance. There's a pretty good chance I'm going to mess something up today. <laughs> but uh, we're going to have fun. We'll catch you out at the ranch. Yeah. So the... Uh, the the deal with with Taylor Swift. If you guys listen to the podcast, you've heard me and Mitch talk about it, and Anthony and Shelby all talk about it quite a bit. Taylor Swift or T Swift is she's a producer. Whether that's in music or that's hunting opportunities, uh, I am one hundred percent serious right now. She, make, she straight up makes opportunities makes for us. She makes it happen. We we listen to her literally every time we go to a hunting elk spot or we are deer hunting and we need some luck, we will straight up put Taylor Swift on. And it used to be a natural thing where she'd have to come over the radio and you couldn't force it, but then we started like actually playing her on purpose and she kept producing. So we're, uh, I don't want to get kicked off YouTube here, but. We're T-Swifting. Yeah. The game. So if I play more, we'll probably get kicked off YouTube. Yeah, but I probably should do that. Aaron, what did you say earlier? <laughs> Here to chew bubble gum and kill turkeys, and I'm all out of bubble gum. I'm all out of bubble gum. There we go. <laughs> so, all right. Next time you see us, we'll be at the ranch. All right, guys. So, all right, guys. We're finally out here at the ranch, and uh, they're shooting guns on this side. So we're gonna go to the other side. It, it sounds like, and there've been turkeys up by somewhere up there. I don't know. I haven't been out here yet before. So, but we're just gonna get a couple practice shots in real quick. Make sure we're good. All right, let's go look at it. See how we're doing. I'd say that's good enough. What do you think? Yeah, I think you're in there. Touching in the middle. Might hit one if you're lucky. We're getting ahead of ourselves first. We still haven't even seen a turkey. So let's go ahead and load up, man. Sounds good. That was too good. Keep moving, just like Elkhorn. I'm carrying around my quiver like a freaking idiot. I lost 
my bracket to my bow. It's like it's your first day. Like it's my first day. <laughs> Maybe you should put on some T-Swift. <laughs> Alright, so we pulled up to the second spot because plan A didn't work out. As soon as we pulled down the driveway, it's like a yard turkey. But uh, it's already moving off following a hen. So we're going to try and follow the creek and just close the distance and try and kill him. Brought the call in case. Mm -hmm. They're out in the field out there. Want to try and bring them in? About 200 yards. Yeah, let's try. Well, oh, maybe we can get the. See that tom up there? Yeah. You see him up there? He's a big one. Yeah. Yeah, he is. Yep. He's right there. Yep. I'm trying to get in between those toms. There's a tom right there. Outsmarted by peanut sized brain. Alright, what's the plan now, Mitch? Keep going after him? Yeah, let's get up there below them. They're just at the top of the, by, kind of by the road up there. Let's bring them back down to the creek. And like five yards, maybe seven yards. And I thought that was the uh, hen with the two big toms. I thought that was it. Turns out it was a different hen. You want to move up on him then, Mitch? Yeah, we better catch him. Okay. We're about to leave the property. Oh, okay. yeah. Go right, 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 right. Stand right there. Stand right there. Stand right there. Stand right here, right there along the fence. Oh, there's your dog. Which one's the dog? The farthest one. I don't think there's any toms in there. They're all jigs. There's one little tom. Is that his? Is that his property across the fence? Um, I don't think so. Well, the one's still on this side of the fence. It's a Jake right there. Yeah, but out behind that tree, though. Oh, he's going over right now. Yeah. So on our way back, we, uh, Long story short, we scared every turkey out this side of the property. <laughs> and on the way back, about 300 yards that way, I could see a giant tom. He's a stud. He's, he's strutting, doing everything. So it's not over. It's not over. So, Mitch, you know how to get there? Yep. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go after him. Got him. 
Yeah. You hit him. He down? He hit. Yeah. I got it on camera. You hit him. Oh, nice. <gasps> How far was he? 52. You should have shot a long time ago, in my opinion. Oh. I didn't have a shot at him. He had trees and stuff. Dude, we had shots down here. Probably yeah. 80 yards. Ooh. Dude, I was shooting like this. I was so off. I was like, like this. <laughs> and I was like, eh, tongue. And then I'm like, oh, that felt low. And then it went right through the hips. He's dead. He's I'm dumb. looking at him. Oh, he's a nice jerky guy. <laughs> Dude, thanks for the help. <laughs> I cannot believe that worked. <laughs> oh, boy. Y'all give him the death poke. Hey. Oh, I... <laughs> I can't believe I'm actually this happy over a turkey. <laughs> like that that was awesome. I would do that again. That was fun. That was legit fun. Oh my gosh. Let's see how big he really is. He looked nice, a little bit smaller when he got up in person, but <clears throat> I was like, there's no way. They puff up, don't they? It's the first time I've ever like touched a turkey neck. <laughs> so pretty, beautiful. Really? That's the proudest six inches I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, guys, that is so cool. You know, we saw him from across the field over here, and uh, spotted him strutting up. He looked ginormous compared to the. Well, I think it's because we were following Jake's around for the last hour. <laughs> That's why he looked so big. Um, but. Yeah, you know, what are you supposed to do with the turkeys? Tail, fan, tail feather fan thing? What is it? Yeah. There you go. <laughs> I, uh, I'm way, actually probably way too excited about this turkey. <laughs> 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 My gosh, guys, thank you so much. I was a little hesitant about the shot there just because I was so off balance, but that rage, uh, that's that new rage. Yeah. You just put those on today. Just put those on today. And uh, beautiful coloring on them. Finally gonna make some turkey jerky. Yep. What an mm -hmm. awesome experience. Spot and stock. Mitch held him in place with the calling. His head, his hen went downhill. Did she come back up? I don't know where she went. I haven't seen her in a while. I figured once she went down there, I'm like, there's no way he's gonna leave that hen. And then uh, just so you guys know, this is the first, actually the second kill today with the uh, budget bow. Um, you know, give that a plug. Everything you see here for less than 500 bucks. Everything you see there. You don't have to go out and buy a 15, you know, $1,500 bow. Last year's bow, I was into that bow, 2,400 bucks. And uh, with the prices just getting out of the roof, I wanted to prove that you could go out and get it done. And, you know, still have a nice bow on a budget. I mean, I'm way too excited about this turkey, guys. <laughs> so. Well, Dave the Devil Dog is going to go make us some turkey jerky, so let's go get this thing over go. to Dave. Good deal. <laughs> Thanks, guys, for the help. Nice job, And uh, as always, guys, if you want to see more, subscribe. This is my first turkey. We take them for granted around here. We were talking off camera about, like, why is this so fun? Like, there's turkeys. And <laughs> we just don't give them enough credit because we have them so many around here that, you know, we could have shot a dozen today and, and not oh, even yeah. blinked with a bow. I mean, but... We held out for a Tom, um, almost shot at Jake, but we held out for a Tom and uh, really happy with the way it worked out. So subscribe if you want to see more guys. And as always, see you on the next one. Bye.